and flamenco Frankenstein, my husband, is here in our house with a spooky recipe that will fill your trick-or-treaters tummies before they head out to collect their candy. I know that our kids love this one, don't they, honey? They do. They certainly do. And they I think all do. kids and family will love this one as well. What are we making? So, a little roasted bloody brains. <gasps> Delicious. One of your favorites. Yes. It's a Halloween staple in our household, really. We do Ooh. love brains around here. Oh, we really we do. do. We do, we do. So, so how do we start with the brains, honey? Absolutely. So I've set us up on two little stations here. So mm -hmm. I know that we fight, and as everybody does, that's fine. We do. So I've given he you your get own. annoying, you know what I mean. And if you don't mind, dear, Husbands. Your, if you notice your roasted, your cauliflower is bigger than mine. Your brain <laughs> is bigger than mine. And this is why we're still married. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Thank you, honey. It's been 3,400. 122 years, I think we're going, it's and I've never time. missed an anniversary. <laughs> so, he never does. Thank you. So we're starting off here. We've got our mixing bowl, if I may, my dear. Yes. Thank you. So we're just going to create a little mixture. We have our beautiful head of cauliflower mm -hmm. starting in first. So canola oil in. Okay. And we're just going to create a great little rub, so to speak. Fresh lime. Lovely. So I've I've also squeezed your lime for you as well. Well, you know. Thank you. Part of the glue of our relationship is that he does all the cooking. We love so that. It's a, it's, it's a team effort. It's it a really team effort. is. Uh, a little bit of cumin, a pinch yeah. of cumin. Okay. Yes. A little bit of curry in there as well. Pinch of curry. Mm -hmm. So a pinch, a pinch is like a half a teaspoon by technical term. Okay, got yeah. it. Uh, <laughs> uh, yes, that's right. Garlic powder. Yeah. A little paprika. I have sweet paprika in there as well. Nice. You can use smoky if you want. And just a little pinch of salt. Yeah. And if you don't mind, a little bit of yogurt. We're going to try to keep our kids a little healthy this year. Oh, that's good. Yes. Yeah. So instead, if you don't have yogurt, you could use, and this is Greek yogurt, so it's good in protein. Nice. Yeah. Uh, and if you don't have yogurt in the house, a little sour cream will do, of course. I like that you make the recipes, you know, a little bit healthy and make sure the kids get their veggies in. Because Absolutely. Because they really do love some brain, especially the nutrients in that. You know what? Woo! It's the smartest thing you can really do for your really? body. Really? <laughs> so let's just pour that all the way over, okay? So again, Ooh, this is like a science experiment in our yes. house, right? So try to get all that out of there. Delish. At the same time, at the same time, I've set that oven to 400 degrees. Okay. So it is preheating and ready nice. to go, which is fantastic. Try to coat that as best as possible. Don't worry, oh. let, you know, gravity do its thing here. Yeah. And it, it looks like slimy and gross it and amazing. Is, it is, it is slimy and gross when it mm -hmm. first starts out. So we're just gonna kick that off to the side. As you do that, look, I'll let you keep working this for a second. Thank you. Thank you, you're welcome. I'm gonna bring this, I'm gonna now pop this into the oven. We've got it at 400 degrees. We're gonna roast this cauliflower off for about 35 to 40 minutes. So much better roasted. It is better roasted. Oh, all the vegetables, this so much better roasted. This kitchen's gonna smell like just beautiful. The aromatics that we have going in, mm -hmm. fantastic. So, okay. one going in, one coming out. Here we are. So just be careful here. So we've got That's this, good. look at this. This does look like Very a brain. Very good, yes. Right, thank you. Let me get these out of your way. Thank you. So let's get into it. So if you can see my lovely knife. Here. Oh my goodness. Don't get any ideas. I if I turn my back, don't Listen, get any ideas. It looks delicious, but Thank no, you. I like the one that you've made. That's perfect. So taco shells. Yes. A flour, you can do corn, you can do anything you'd like. These are brain tacos. These are brain tacos. Yeah. So I'm just gonna cut you a little bit here. And again, yeah. this is fun for the house, right? So when you're finished, you stick it in, yeah? Yes. Let's not forget a little bit of this, though. We're getting a little bit of... Brain juice. A little bit of brain juice. Yes. A little bit of sriracha on here as well. Very nice. And look at this, by the way. I might add. Oh, look, let's just sell. Little, little googly little eyes. Christian Dare, rock you and roll. Well have some fun. It is the season, it is, right? It is the season. Love that. So if you... I'm going to do this one here for you. I like this. This is almost like we're in Mexico here, just spooning them in. <laughs> I'm going to just do it this way. Cut and go. Very nice. I want you to garnish. So the thing is okay. to garnish That's bar. Great, Thank you, garnish bar. So you could use cotilla, cotilla cheese. Yeah. I've got feta for a little bit of bite. Nice. Some pomegranate in there, some cilantro. Yeah. Spoon it as you want. Is there anything that we're missing up top that you may think that the kids might like? I don't know. I think this is perfect. I mean, the pomegranate looks like, you know, gross oozing blood. <laughs> what about, <laughs> I just love what, that. What about Halloween candy? Oh, Halloween candy right? should be involved in should everything. Should be, I agree. Absolutely. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. I and like that you you pick some feta, they get some extra protein yeah. there. A little bit of sharpness, right? And then a little bit of greens. Thank you. And you can finish if you want a little bit more of this. I always love the brain juice. Yes, we do it's love brain juice. very good. Especially when it comes out of the brain jar. <laughs> there we go. Bon very appetito. nice. See, this is simple. So this think is about fun. This the kids for can all do it. Yes, a very quick, fun Halloween themed snack that the whole family will enjoy. Get extra nutrients and protein there in your brain tacos. <laughs> Very good. Very good.
my love. Very nice.